Happy New Week. We are kicking off our bottom 15 reactions for Eurovision 2015. And I am so excited. 2015, the top 15, I just, I don't think there was one song that I didn't like. And so super excited to get into the bottom 15 because based off of what I know about the songs already, even without having seen the live performances in so long, I feel like it'll probably be the same. So I do have a nice glass of wine tonight because it has been a long day and it's gonna be a long evening because I have to uh, finish my master's edits and then uh, plan for a guest lecture for the class I'm TAing for. But I also have good news. I'll share it in another video though. So we are starting off with Austria who came second to the bottom in the grand final with zero points, um, unfortunately. But before we get into that, make sure to like this video and please consider subscribing if you haven't. But in 2015, Austria was sending I Am Yours by the Make Makes. Make Makes, I suppose. So let's go ahead and get into this. And this is the host entry because Austria won 2014. So that gives us a little bit more color. So can't wait to get into it. Make notes, yeah. Silhouetted lighting. That's really nice. You're a lesson I love learning so any town that you've got. See, this voice is really nice. Don't you know? I said, okay, hat. I like any people who come like hats like that. Any place I'm yours. Like the Zibs hat. <laughs> I can't wear it, so I like when other people can't. <laughs> Look at that guy. There's like, every year at Eurovision, there's somebody that looks like that. <laughs> every year. <laughs> like that. <laughs> oh. Ooh, I like that kind of mixed register. Like, oh, that was good. Doing something to me. <laughs> you know what I mean? He said, he did some black magic shit. <laughs> I'm like, was that just for effect? Or did that really ignite the blaze? <laughs> he said, Ooh, I like when he does this. And I like the song a lot too. to be so hot standing close to that piano. Oh, that's really pretty. That burst of warmth. That's what I was waiting for. <laughs> Give it to me. Yo, he can sing. I like that. This is what I'm saying. Like, I feel like even the entries that didn't do great at Eurovision 2015 are still gonna be like really good for me. <laughs> because 
Like that was really good. Like I think this is an underrated Austrian entry, especially considering his vocals. The vocals really are something special. They're really nice, really textured at some parts, but really smooth in other parts. I really like that kind of mixed register that he goes into in certain parts of the song. And then I liked how he set the piano on fire. And then um, a couple of bars later, the whole stage uh, turned like orange yellow, kind of reflecting that warmth from the fire of the piano. So reflecting that like last chorus of the song. So that was really cool. Overall, I do think this, this should have gotten some points. Like, come on. Like, this didn't get any points. Nobody wanted to get this points. Anyway, I know it may not have been incredibly um, memorable. I like it. I would. Re I remember this. But I guess I could see how it wouldn't be. But even if it's not particularly memorable, I think it is very good. And so I want to know what you think about this. Let me know. If you like this video, please like it. And please consider subscribing if you haven't. But anyway, thank you for clicking on this video. Thank you for watching this video. And as always, I'll see you next time.